Hi there, um, my name's Ferrari and I would like to share a problem I had and the workaround I got and maybe it will help someone somewhere in the world. Um, it all started with an app I wanted to use called VC Listen from Soundcraft. And um, the problem was that when we wanted to set up the app, there was a certain value in the settings that you needed to change. But when you go into that white box, into the little value um, box, you can't change it because when you open it, there's no return key. So you change the numbers, but there's no way to say OK or accept or return or enter. And that's a problem because when you go back out and you go back in, it remains unchanged and you need to change it to connect um, to our church's mixing desk. That's not important. Um, so what I did is I downloaded a app called Grammarly Keyboard and um, this is a workaround. So I think um, it'll help someone. Then you go into your settings to your keyboard and basically what you do is you install um, the Grammarly Keyboard and then you delete your English keyboard. And that's obviously the English keyboard is where the numpad is lying without the return key. So now without the English keyboard, when you go into the white box, you get a normal keyboard with a return key. And that fixes the problem. So now we could actually change the value and it worked very well. And then if you want to lastly, you can obviously delete the keyboard again if you don't need it for any other purposes um, and you can just reinstall the, the English keyboard which you don't even need to download. It will already be there in your settings. So I hope this helps someone somewhere in the world um, how to get a return key on an iPad on an iPhone.